play golf. But his game was put on hold when he fell down while walking in his neighborhood. There was a hole there, like a mouse hole. They caught my left foot. And it just kept it. And once it started, I couldn't stop it. It was slow motion for a minute. And then it was like somebody pushed me. Bam. As I fell, I put my hands up like this. So I could stop myself from getting the concrete. My hands went down. My elbows went down. And my head went down. And I looked over the cement. And I could see my friend coming down. And I, and I tried to get up at first. Go back in. I never felt so weak in my life for a minute. I asked him, you know, when the runner is a cow, fill it with ice and bring it out to In the meantime, I took my phone out of my pocket, dialed 911, and answered an ambulance. They were only three blocks away, and they came right up. So that was, ended up at St. James House. Patrick needed 13 stitches in his forehead, which healed. But the pain in his right elbow continued for three years. I need to remind her that I had a problem with my elbows. When I put them down on something, put your elbow down and ah, electricity going up your arm. Patrick and his wife Denise were watching the 700 Club when Terry had a word of knowledge for Patrick. I an elbow issue, really a hard time. It caused pain in the joints of your elbow from a past injury. God is totally reconstructing a new one for me. Then the next thing I know, Immediately, he said, I think I've been painful. Still had a smoke. That's why the next day I got it. That's why I really got it. So they weren't there anymore. And I just kept hanging out the hall all day long. And I still do every day. Yeah. Because that is incredible. And I kept checking it for weeks. And that bone did not real good. I don't even know where the bones went. Well, I gotta go, folks. Enough of that silliness. <laughs> Hope you enjoy it.